Indian Sandalwood by Alfred Dunhill. This is where carrots <laughs> meet culture in a bottle. It's almost like a gentleman's garden party. Okay, sophisticated yet earthy. But here's the million dollar question. Is it a groundbreaking masterpiece of perfumery or is it just another woody wonder in the endless sea of fragrances? Let's find out. I like the I like the nice little um, touch here. Feels very grippy. Are you? If you follow me, you already know this is gonna be something for me. I'll definitely like it a lot because of the nature of the scent. Yep. All right. So here we have again Indian sandalwood by Alfred Dunhill. This is generally a, a woody, creamy, and powdery fragrance which some people don't like powdery fragrances i personally have absolutely no problem with them i actually like them a lot this came out in 2019 and is part of dunhill's signature collection if you subscribe like uh the 30 percent of you watching have already done then you can follow me how i list this one and the others from the collection on ebay so you can buy them right here right now but this one is not even that expensive compared to some of the more uh, luxury fragrances. I think I've seen it around a hundred bucks online. So it's not too bad for to give it a try. Um, generally, the key fragrance notes in here, as I mentioned before, it's carrot. It's uh, bergamot, auris, musk, sandalwood, and uh, I think a little bit of patchouli as well. Overall, people like it. Um, it's, it's got genuinely uh, positive feedback from the community. I, again, would give this a four and a half out of five because it's uh, generally moderately long to long lasting. So it's not too bad. It's medium to strong silage as well. And it's considered to be suitable more for men than for women. And I would agree with that. However, some people uh, still say it's a unisex fragrance, but you know, that's up to you to decide. Um, generally, again, I think it's a good value that you get for the price of around $100. Sometimes you see it cheaper as well on, uh, even on Walmart, I think I've seen it. Uh, Amazon has a version as well. I'll link it below so you can support the channel. And for those of you who already know where this is going, this is going to be on my eBay store and you can check it out in the link below. One little fact that uh, comes up every once in a while in discussions about this fragrance is that people actually compare this to Dior Homme Intense, okay? And also a little bit of uh, Terre d'Hermes, okay? So, you know, if you wanna get something and these are kind of the fragrances that you already like, maybe that's something for you. Generally, earthy, creamy, with a little bit of a carrot note and uh yeah i'd give it a four four and a half out of five that being said check this one out and follow me for the next one bye bye